Hey guys, this is Dookie Hong, chef of Sunday restaurants in San Francisco. I'm here in Korea. I don't know where I am, so we have Monica here, our local expert. Can you let us know where we are and what we're doing here? So we're at Chumunjin Seafood Market, which is the largest fish market on the eastern coast of Korea. We had the boats pulling in with the day's catch around 7 a.m. And then we're gonna get some of the fresh seafood that's been straight off the boat, and then bring it to a restaurant, cook it up, eat it. All of that sounds incredible. Let's go check out the market. Sure. So this right here is fugu or the blowfish. So the poisonous fish that is very dangerous, but super delicious. She's actually preparing it for sashimi. And anyone who handles this needs to be licensed. So she has a license right over there, stating that she can handle this fish. Incredible. So here we have the squid, which is what Chumunjin Seafood Market is most famous for. If you look out to the front, you'll see a huge squid. monument of a squid there. So squid is really incredible. It's, it's obviously we know it as calamari. You can eat it raw, like fermented in like a kind of a red bean paste, chili, like a spicy version. You can stuff it like a sausage. Obviously we can fry it in kind of the traditional methods. So the squid is super versatile and I guess that's one of the reasons that Chumunjin has kind of made it their mascot. Well, red snow crab I heard is in season, so let's look for some of that. So now we have a huge bag of crab that we got for 30,001 and he's bringing us to a restaurant around this area so that they can prepare it for us, they'll cut it up, steam it. They'll also be throwing some crab into a stew. Usually it's pretty spicy mm -hmm. and spicy then stew. later with like the leftover crab shells, uh -huh. they'll throw some rice in there and mix right. it up with all, all the guts, all the and, the guts and whatever is left up in there. So we'll have at mm -hmm. least three versions yes. of all the same that we just bought mm -hmm. from the market. Yep. Awesome, super excited. So this is one of the ways that the crab we bought can be prepared wow. in the form of a stew. It's a spicy stew with crab all cut up yeah. thrown in there with a lot of vegetables like bean sprouts and carrots. Some onions in there, you got some cream chili pepper powder. Wow, it looks really good. So this is the first way to have it. It's a great thing to have kind of, I guess in the morning is great to have, just kind of wake you up, probably after drinking. It's a great hangover food. Mm -hmm. okay. The market lady gave us some free shrimp, so she's adding that. Just to kind of add to that seafood crab flavor, super tasty. Honestly, as this, as this reduces, it'll get more intense. And then you could eat it with rice, you could eat it kind of by itself. So we kind of want to wait and it'll just kind of stew right in front of you. And now we have our crab, it's steamed. I think when the seafood is so fresh, all you have to do is just steam it, like just don't mess around with it. So we're just gonna go in, dig in, have some of the steamed crab, and also have some of the soup, and we're gonna wait for the rice to come. <laughs> wow. <laughs> mm. Oh, that is, that's like salty. So, salty. Yeah. I don't think they salt it in mm. any way. So we're all finishing up here. The stew was incredible. We went to town on our steamed crab. So our dessert is crab rice. So what they do is they take the shell with all the guts and all the crab juice and they mix it with steamed rice, a little bit of sesame oil, some sesame seeds, a little bit of seaweed. That's it, keep it simple. And this, I feel like, is kind of the dish that captures the essence of the crab. We just finished our meal. We're super stuffed and this whole experience from watching it getting caught, being bought, and coming to a restaurant where it was freshly prepared, I feel like is the full fish market experience. So yeah, thanks for joining us. <laughs>